Hi there, it's Pat from Psychit. I'd just like to introduce you to the AeroClan. This, um, this is something I've designed to replace the canvas saddlebags uh, for all road bikes and, and mountain bikes. So, um, yeah, I've been a long time developing these. We, we first started in 2014. So there's been a heap of development with little strengthening changes, especially for the road bike market, especially to take the larger bottom section and the extra weight. Uh, and just lots of little refinements, as much as I could do then, and I sent them out to the wider cycling community, global cycling community, where we're um, getting feedback from all different environments, from, from icy cold to snow to, to deserts and all sorts of conditions. So um, I've acted on pretty much all the feedback I've had back and uh, I've just, just finished refining now. Um, yeah, so we're, we're ready to go. Um, so yeah, this is the P1 top here. It's got more of a concave across there and to, to suit saddles with more of a concave. So this is the P1 fitted. And uh, then there's the P2 top, which is a lot flatter across the top. And that's um, designed for a lot of the fabric saddles and also Ciel Italia. Uh, but there's a lot of crossover right through specialised all the way through, but um, by far the P1 is more common, but if you have a look on the website, it's on the image gallery and on the um, FAQ page, number one on the FAQ page, uh, you, you'll, see, you'll see everything that the Aeroclams fit so far that we know about, and there's plenty more saddles, brand makes and models to come. Um, come in black and white, so you can either have full white or swap your halves around if you've got a black and white saddle. And um, and also three different sizes. So yeah, that's that's small there. So this is the small, and then uh, this is the medium bottom section. This is actually the one that we're on Kickstarter for. It's uh, this is actually a really delicate prototype. I just got it back this morning, so I painted it black, spray bombed it black, and I just cut up a larger latch and stuck it together to just for the fit out to show you the swapping between one to the other. So. Um, yeah, that's that. Uh, we, we hope to get uh, a fair bit of interest in this because it's, it's really expensive to tool for, to make the injection moulds. It's about, um, about 27,000 New Zealand dollars. And by the time all the shipping logistics and everything, it pushes it up over to 40,000 New Zealand dollars. I'm not too sure what that is. It must be 33 US or something like that. You'd have to check. Um, so yeah, that, that's, that's, what we're, that's what we're promoting on Kickstarter. And then, um, and of course, the larger bottom section, and that takes um, that takes two tubes, two canisters, and um, and the cavity at the bottom there. They've all got that cavity, uh, a slimline multi-tool plus an inflator, and uh, two tire levers, which we supply with the Aeroclam kit. Um, so they swap out in seconds. And this is this is the P1. This is the content of the small bottom section. You see I've got a CO2 canister. We supply the uh, rubber cut-off tube to go over that, to, just in case it rattles. Um, inflator, we supply the levers and, and of course there's the road bike tube in there. So um, yeah, it's nicely tightly compacted in there, compressed, so no rattling. It's actually the compression that stops them rattling. So if you do happen to get a larger bottom section or even the midsection, there's a bit of extra space. What you have to do is just um, fill any unwanted space with either plastic lunch wrap rolled up in a ball or some bubble wrap or just a piece of cloth just to keep that compression in there, stop things moving around. So very, very compact, even the small, uh, sorry, the larger bottom section is very, very compact. Um, and that's about it. So we could we could really do with the support, likes, shares, especially shares. Just uh, we've got some really good rewards on, on Kickstarter, you, you'll find. So, um, yeah, that's about it from us. Um, thank you very much, and hope to get your support on Kickstarter. Thank you.